second. Do you think that, do you think we made it to the moon? Do you think we landed on the moon to begin with? I'm just curious. <clears throat> I did, I did for years, you know, but now after you think about it, did we really? I, I believe we did. I think we did too. I, but there's one thing that bothers me. <clears throat> Why is the logistics so hard now? That's what I'm, I haven't had time to look on. When that. in '68 and '69, it was just like a, you know, within within a year, you know, racing the Russians, <clears throat> we put that together in a year, and supposedly got it done. I think it's the same reason. I think this is going to make a good one. Um, I believe it's the same reason why it's harder to make a hit record right now. Um, because humans overthink things. Um, that's what I love about your record. We haven't overthought things. I mean, maybe a couple things we may have, but for the majority, the record, man, blow and go, and we're recording artists. We're making, you know, and I think that's how it was back then with with NASA. I think they were like, okay, doesn't matter. We're not looking at radiation. We're not looking at putting a hole in the ozone. We're not looking at, um, we're not looking, we know how much fuel it's going to take us to get there according to our satellites that we put up there. And we know what's going to protect the astronauts when they come back alive and everything else, fuck it, we're going to the moon. Yeah. But now you got all these people, younger people, that are overthinking everything. Well, what's going to what's going to cause us to have less radiation? How are we going to land? How are we going to take off? And back then, man, I just hate to say it, but men were more men, I think, and they they had more balls. And I think that Neil Armstrong had the bigger balls out of all of them. Well, how in the hell did they know that they wasn't going to land in the Painted Desert or in the Andes Mountains when when they went off in that capsule? Because they had tested it so many times, and you know. Apollo, even though there was sixty percent or seventy percent of the Earth was water, right? You know, what, what was what was it? Apollo eleven that landed, right? Uh, so there was eleven before that. Um, what Apollo ten circled or went to the dark side of the moon? I think Apollo nine. I can't remember. Apollo thirteen never landed. They went on the other side, but they came home. They slingshotted to get home, and they barely made it back. Um, and that have you seen that movie? Uh, Tom Hanks is in it. Mm -hmm. Okay, here's here's another here's here's my problems with some <clears> of the <throat> things that they tell us, and I don't think is completely the truth. Um, like the angle you have to hit to get back into the atmosphere. Um, I, I think I think there's a much bigger angle than what they're saying, and I think they're finding that out now. I think that. From what I can see, the reason why it's so much harder logistically to get back there is simply because because we're just thinking about all these things that, that we didn't think about before. We didn't think about um, we didn't think about comfort. We didn't think about we didn't think about anything like that. We didn't think about entertainment Failure on our way there. or anything, yeah. No, what we were we were on our way to beat the Russians and to get up there. They had beat us in every way. Um, we had already sent around a man to go that, that, that shot up there. What was his name? Um, the first one. Um, oh, no, no. That, that was the guy who died. It was, um, he was the guy who first made a trip around the earth. You know, he's the one who first, um, oh, heck, um, can you look up who that was? He was the guy that first got up there and, and did around, went, went around the earth. We shot monkeys up there. We shot dogs up there. We were prepared, you know, and we had a nation the Russians, I think, were the first one with the, the monkey. Yeah, yeah, they were. Yeah. But we were a nation of workers. Workers. We were a nation of proud people who did not want to get beat.